Like I said, for whatever reason, he really has the best effect when I come over here over the guard away from the play. I don't know if it's if that has the effect of shifting the line. There you go once again. Like I said, untouched. He just runs right past lane. Like I said, I've been running this a lot. Sometimes I see him, he doesn't even touch him. Need some fast, cheap, reliable muck coins? Go to MMOXP.com and use discount code MONEYSHOT for 5% off your order. Link in the description below. Welcome back, YouTubers and Madden fans. This is Mad Money Shot. Sniff out the Madden cheese as always. Got a defensive video for you today, a blitz. Uh, I've been doing a lot of labbing uh, for my Kansas City Chiefs uh, defensive ebook, which is what I'm in right now, even though I'm in the Packers. Um, ultimately, this is uh, the first ebook on defense I'm going to put out. It'll either be out Sunday or Monday. Uh, so make sure to check back for that on my site, madmoneyshot.com, if you guys want to pick that up. Uh, you guys have been doing great supporting me with the books so far on offense, so I'm going to switch it over and put out a defensive book before I finish the offensive books. Uh, but I found a lot of great blitzes out of this, especially out of the big nickel over G. Hit the like button uh, if you want to see more blitzes out of this particular uh, defensive book. Um, or just hit the like button to help me out, help my channel out. You guys are doing great with that as well. I appreciate all the love and support you guys are giving me. Other than that, we're going to go ahead and get into the blitz today. Uh, this is probably the glitchiest blitz that I've seen out of all these plays. Um, it's out of the quarter normal. I don't even think you can find the quarter normal in a lot of different defensive playbooks anymore. Um, this, the reason I chose this playbook is because of some of the more rare, suddenly rare formations that used to be in every playbook, like the big nickel over G and like the quarter normal, which I don't think you can really find too much more. But this particular uh, blitz I'm about to show you with the cover two spy, uh, I think this has got to be a glitch because the defensive lineman, or the offensive lineman, I mean, doesn't even block the guy. So we're just going to go ahead. I'm not going to make any adjustments. I have Adrian Amos running in this spot. On offense, I really find it works best if there's not a blocking running back, which I know a lot of people aren't going to necessarily be doing, but you got to give this uh, play what it's worth. Basically, empty backfield looks, which I run a lot. A lot of people run a lot of empty backfield looks. That's what's going to work best, and that's what I'm going to run against today. So I'm just going to pick something with some deeper patterns, the middle high-low, which is an offensive video that I just recently put out and play I really like uh, and I've noticed a lot of people are running that because every time I run it now it's like people know it's coming based off the formation so you guys are obviously using that like crazy as well the best part about this play is there really is no setup it's it's just something it's like a bug in the game so all I'm really gonna do I'll guess pass a lot of times sometimes I'll bring this guy down over the guard sometimes I'll shift the line uh, stuff like that because ultimately what the cornerback's going to do over Lane Johnson is the play and you probably saw it right there he got the playoff I gotta be honest I really wasn't watching too much the coverage aspect that I was supposed to be doing we'll go to the replay this wasn't even a clean run off the edge uh, he'll get much cleaner runs off the edge but this cornerback right here is the glitch and you're going to see that in the blocking animation he essentially cannot be blocked he's basically like like lane is just he's just running right through lane johnson which is insane considering he's one of the best tackles in the league this is actually one of the best blocking animations you're going to see uh typically it's almost like lane's on skates and he doesn't even get his hands on the cornerback we'll do this a couple times so as far as the play goes like i said i don't really have to do anything i typically just try to get um i typically i honestly try to go over here and this is pretty much where uh where this play will have the most success guessing pass is about as far as i'll go uh, but you'll see some of the animations that we get here it's like a turbo block you see right there lane did not even touch the guy it's like he runs through him We'll go to the replay a couple of times, probably every time, just to show you what I'm talking about. I'm going against the computer. He's going to get rid of the ball. But watch how this guy, like I said, he just doesn't really get hands on him. And if he does, he's not really doing anything. It's almost like he just sprints right through him to the quarterback. All the other linemen are getting in their typical blocking animations where this guy will eventually just get around lane every time. So let's go and let's go do it a couple more times. I want to get some sack animations here. Uh, but like I said, I, I typically find it's best just to bring this guy over here. That's all I really have to do. Uh, I don't even feel like I have to guess pass most of the time. As you can see, once again, he's just coming off that edge. And I once again, I should have been, like I said, I'm not really watching <laughs> the coverage like I would be in a game. I'm just watching that cornerback because it's incredible to me to see the way this looks. And there's a couple plays I'll show you in this formation that look very similar. They do not have this effect. So like I said, watch this guy right here. He's just, he, he's just not getting blocked. He just sprints through the block. And I don't know, it's because... I mean, I don't know if it's because he's so much faster. Like I, was, like I said, I'll show you some plays in, in this formation where he just gets straight plowed, unlike what he's doing right now. Like I said, for whatever reason, he really has the best effect when I come over here over the guard away from the play. I don't know if it's, if that has the effect of shifting the line. There you go once again. Like I said, untouched. If you saw on that play, we're not getting, we're not actually getting the sack animations that we would be getting in a game. But if you're watching there, he went in untouched. Let's do that one more time. 
Go to that replay because this this is insane to me. Out of all the the lack of pressure that people complain about this year as far as blitzes, then you come across something like this where he literally doesn't even get, like, he just runs right past Lane. For what reason? I don't know. If it's not a speed thing. Lane Johnson's one of the fastest, best linemen in the game, and he just straight poops on him like a swinging door. He's treating him like a swinging door right now, and it's just like he, it's, it's like some, I, as, like I said, I've been running this a lot. Sometimes I see him, he doesn't even touch him. So like I said, I'm labbing this for my ebook. I didn't even get a chance to run this in game yet. I just wanted to give this to you guys to basically ruin this game, uh, you know, ruin the online for me before I get a chance to do this. And then when I play, I'll see it again. I'll see it every single play. There you go. Once again, like I said, I mean, that's just as I, as I, like I said, I wasn't really trying on the defensive side at all. I'm just watching this dude run past lane. So I wish I had a better setup for you guys. You know what I mean? Like I said, sometimes I shift it. I haven't really found like what's the most ideal setup. I haven't even tried shifting it away. I just found this and I was like, man, I got to give this to you guys for people that want to get some crazy pressure for no reason. Like I said, this is not something that should be happening. You see right there, like it's almost like it's like a turbo blitz out of nowhere. Like he, he <laughs> it's insane. Like there's nothing really, there's no rhyme or reason that this should be happening. This is a, this is a true to, 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 you know, true to form glitch. Like I said, right here, he's by all means, he's sucked up. Like I said, he's really just the way this blocking is going on. There's no like real suction going on. Like sometimes when the block happens these guys get sucked into the block he's basically just like sprinting through it and then boom he just like turbos through that was actually the best block that lane put on him but you can tell he's not really like he's not really like solid at any point in time is he solid in blocking this guy he's just kind of running into him there's no real like his hands are holding him up nothing like there's no real animations aside from this it's almost like ea forgot to do the animations for this play and this guy's almost acting like he's not there just sprinting through and eventually he just gets through lane but there's no hand fighting like the other guys you can see these guys here they're hand fighting they're they're they're, they're engaged there's nothing like that on, on all these guys you're seeing that these, these animations it's like they forgot to do the animation for this and he's treating him like he's not there there's no hand fighting he's just sprinting through and eventually he gets through that's why i mean this is a glitch it's like a lack of programming that you guys can exploit and use to your benefit online if you guys want to do that and before they've patched this i'm sure this will get patched pretty quick so that's it that's the vid uh, if you guys want to see more blitzes like this or you want to check out my ebook when it drops uh either tomorrow or the next day uh you can check that out link will be in the description below other than that thanks for watching that much it out so that's it. That's the video. If you guys want to see more blitzes, uh, I got a lot of them now. Uh, now that I've been labbing this book heavy, so they're all going to be out of KC. Or check out the full ebook. It's going to be uh, it's going to be a big one. Dropping either tomorrow or Monday. Uh, link in the description below. Other than that, thanks for watching, man. I want to shout out. Need more help or just want to show your support? Then head over to my Patreon and join my team, where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays, as well as early access to my bids and more. Link in the description below.